All right, hey guys, just wanted to give you an update on me. Um, I know I told you yesterday that I had a uh, big neurology appointment coming up today that kind of would tell me where I stood or where the noggin stood. So uh, the appointment went real well. Um, I feel good about it. I was somewhat released to go back to work, and if you want to call it that, uh, starting Thursday, I'll be able to go back and um, uh, for a couple hours a day and and do behind the desk work. So that's going to be interesting because you guys that know me know that me sitting still behind a desk is going to be a big challenge. But I have to do it. Um, you know, it's I know it's part of of healing and it's necessary and and uh, it's in God's plan, God's will. So I'll definitely obey um, the doctors and and. Um, so it's, uh, but it's something, it's a step in the right direction. Real excited about being back with my coworkers and uh, very excited about seeing my customers. Um, you know, you, when you're the same place and, and you built a place basically for eight years, been there and you've, you've had customers, repeat customers coming in for, um, you know, a lot of them for the whole entire eight years. It's, uh, it's tough when you, when you don't see them um, so it's I'm excited about seeing them and it you know even if it is just standing behind a uh, glass sliding door or whatever but at least I'll be able to see them and and uh, say hey and, and I'm excited about that so again it's step in the right dire direction it's uh, I'll do that you know and, and see how it goes over a certain period of time and then we'll just take it slow and you know add a little time to that each you know each I don't know week and uh, just see how I'm able to tolerate it uh, company's been amazing I can't say enough about about the company and and what they've done and, and really stepped up and and shown their concern and care for me and are, are just willing to to uh, let me kind of come back as as uh, slow as I need to and, and that's what they're worried about and um, worried about me just coming back uh, better and and that's meant a lot you know my guys and, and the whole company just really reaching out and doing whatever it, it takes to make this uh, last month as easy as possible for me and I'm, I'm real appreciative of that and words can't express you know the gratitude I have towards towards a company that but you know when you're with a company that long and uh, and a company like that, it shouldn't surprise you. Um, but we'll see. You know, I have four or five tests that the neurologist lined up or, or is in the process of lining up, getting scheduled. Uh, most of them are, are repeats that I've had over the last month. A um, couple of them, one or two of them are new tests, and, and they're just kind of precautionary just based on some of the side effects that I'm, I'm still showing or symptoms I'm still showing just kind of make sure something else isn't causing them they don't feel like anything other than the fact that um, you know you just you never know with a with a brain injury you never know with with a severe concussion or a traumatic brain injury um, how you're gonna heal I mean each person you know unfortunately heals different and uh, this has been kind of a learning experience for me is is seeing all the different things that um, kind of goes on as the brain heals and is bruised and and um, it's amazing how what you know God has created up inside that skull it's it's phenomenal and then there's people out there that say that just it just happened uh, wow I mean if anything seeing you know if I was an unbeliever before all this I tell you what I would it would definitely have converted me because it's a it shows you that that doesn't just happen. Uh, God has created just an amazing um, organ that just uh, God controls everything and most things you don't even think about until until you can't do them and then you realize, wow, you know, it's uh, an injury can affect that. So uh, again, great appointment in my opinion. Um, I kind of went into it thinking that it was going to be longer. I was going to have to wait longer to get back and start trying to put back a normal routine 
what I'm used to and have been used to over the the last uh, you know 16 years um, now I just have to wait a couple days so I'm excited uh, about that so again I appreciate all your prayers I mean prayer prayer absolutely works and uh, you know I knew it before but seeing it now um, you know directed at me it, it's just been a humbling experience and and I can't can't thank you enough so keep praying I uh, still have some healing to do but uh, pray for my patience I know I've said that before but that's where I struggle and I just uh, give me the patience to do exactly what what I'm told to do and and let the uh, the healing just be done properly and and uh, you know when I come back completely I'll be a hundred percent so again thank you and I just wanted to update you on on the noggin Wednesday night tomorrow night if you guys you know have nothing going on you'd like to come out and visit um, we're doing it at Liberty Community Church we're gonna have hot dogs and hamburgers and whatever goes along with that and then a bunch of desserts usually and uh, that's at 615 and then Bible study I'll start that at 7 o'clock so if you're hungry you want to eat come out and join us um, of course you can bring something if you want but if not just bring an appetite and uh, come out and fellowship with us and, and eat a free meal and then uh, sit down and have Bible study at 7 o'clock or if you want to just show up for Bible study some people do that and just show up at 7 o'clock and uh, Wednesday nights are, are so laid back come you know wear whatever you want wear wear whatever you're comfortable in a lot of people show up in their work clothes because they come straight from work gives them a chance to eat don't have to worry about going home and cooking and things like that um, you know I'll, I'll usually be up there preaching and in wore out blue jeans cowboy boots and you know t-shirt and, and a sports coat thrown over a t-shirt you, you never know with me I mean of course I do that on Sunday morning sometimes too so uh, but just you know love to have you come out and visit and, and just uh, love to see you guys so again thank you for the prayers and i hope you have a wonderful evening